Hi everyone, this is Mr. Dave, and for this video I'm going to go through and uh, quickly show you how to set up multiple cameras. Now, for a lot of the videos uh, so far, I've only set up one camera, so I'm going to start with actually just going up to, of course, our homepage. configuration and we're going to be looking at the configuration files and what you need to do when you're setting up uh, multiple cameras is keep in mind that the motion dot config or conf file is actually kind of the overall master file and then you set up a separate camera file for every one of the cameras that you want and within those you set up the parameters that are unique to the camera so motion will start off by reading this motion config file and then it'll open up a particular camera file and then overwrite those values with uh, the items that are particular so what uh, it's probably easiest to actually show this by way of example here, so I'm going to go off, and first off, we'll actually see that there actually is some samples. In the particular file, so we're, we're going to start off by, actually, I'll just actually use these files. The name actually doesn't make much of a difference. So I'm going to edit this motion.config file. So by default, it's actually going to use all of these values here. And then it's going to get all the way down to the bottom. And then it's going to open up these camera files. So the camera file that uh, we have currently sitting out there is that one. And then I'm going to set up another one. Set up three. So the main parameters are going to be in red from this motion config file, and then I'm going to set up three cameras. They'll actually be specified in every each one of these three files, uh, which will actually overwrite the, uh, the values uh, from above from the motion file. So for this one, uh, I'll set up my RTSP camera. And uh, we'll give it uh, 1280 by 720. And we'll call this, we'll stick with the default, we'll call it camera uh, my camera. And then for the second one, for the second camera, we're actually going to go in and use the file option uh, that you may have seen in one of the other videos. Oh, 
And I think this one is the Rotate 90 degrees on that particular camera. And then we'll set up camera 3. not need that. These can all be different resolutions uh, that would be applicable for your camera. Rotate to 70. Now let's actually start up motion. And we'll go off and we'll see whether it works. And uh, we see that we have the uh, three cameras actually showing on the preview page, uh, as well as the RTSP camera uh, coming through. So you can do this for just about as, as many cameras as you'd uh, like to get set up. And this uh, web control will actually allow you to actually pick in between them. These are the camera names that were actually specified uh, within those configuration uh, files. Um, and allows you to go through and make uh, adjustments to that. And Again, uh, you can include as many camera files or um, as cameras you have. Uh, I have not come across any particular limit uh, so far. Hope that helps.